I never could have ever anticipated or predicted that my nerdy little life in neuroscience would have ever crossed paths with my hobby, and that is sports. Uh, so in our first year of operation at Halo, we were more like a research institute than a business. So we tested a thousand people before we made any decisions as to how we're going to apply this in a commercial context. So after testing a thousand people, the research program that yielded the most robust and consistent results relied on stimulating the special part of the brain that controls movement in our bodies. And we found that if you paired this neurostimulation with movement-based training, that we would see dramatically accelerated results in the way people learned. So then we started thinking, like, who needs to move for a living? It's athletes. So on that day, we became a sports company. Okay, so by applying an electric field to specific parts of the brain, uh, you can induce temporary states of what neuroscientists called hyperplasticity or hyperlearning. So a 20 minute application with our neurostimulation will induce a 60 minute window of hyperlearning. So in the sports application, let's target the neurostimulation to this part of the brain that controls movement. It's called the motor cortex. Do that for 20 minutes and then do your athletic training, and then feed your brain training repetitions. Like our promise to the athlete is that they will acquire that knowledge, that movement-based knowledge at an accelerated rate versus not using the technology.